Hi everybody, welcome to Ace Engineering Academy and Ace Online. Here is a very interesting notification that was released by Gale for GATE 2025 aspirants. Okay, so through GATE 2025, this recruitment is going to happen. Now let us see the details of this particular recruitment. Okay, so here Gale, a government of India undertaking. So career opportunities as executive trainee through GATE 2025. So, Gale is a Maharatna PSU and India's flagship natural gas company in, in, is integrating all aspects of the natural gas value chain. Okay, so this is what he has given and its related services about Gale. So, Gale invites applications from Indian nationals, only Indian nationals dear students, fulfilling the eligibility criteria for filling up various posts in executive cadre by using GATE 2025 marks as per the details given at table 1 below. So, let us see the details in the table 1, what is given here. So, post name, executive trainee chemical, E2 cadre, pay scale is 60,000 to 180,000. Bachelor's degree in engineering in chemical, petrochemical, chemical technology, petrochemical technology, chemical technology and polymer science chemical technology and plastic technology with minimum 65 percent marks. So, minimum percentile of marks is 65 percent marks and executive trainee instrumentation E2 pay scale is between 60,000 to 180,000. This is per month dear students. Okay. And bachelor's degree in engineering in instrumentation, instrumentation and control, electronics and instrumentation, electrical and instrumentation, electronics electrical and electronics with minimum 65 percent marks that is what is given here then executive trainee electrical e2 cadre 60000 to 180000 is the pay scale and bachelor's degree in engineering in electrical electrical electronics and power electrical and electronics electrical and power with minimum 65 percent marks is given then executive trainee mechanical E2 cadre 60,000 to 180,000 is the pay scale. Bachelor's degree in engineering in mechanical production, production and industrial, manufacturing, mechanical and automobile with 65% marks. So minimum 65% marks is required for each and every post dear students. Then executive trainee BIS E2 cadre 60,000 to 180,000. Bachelor's degree in engineering in computer science and information technology with minimum 65% marks. Bachelor's degree with minimum 60% marks and master's degree in computer applications MCA of minimum 2 years with minimum 65% marks. So, computer science MCA students also can apply for that particular post here dear students. And Coming to the relaxation in minimum percentage of marks in educational qualification, relaxation of 5% in minimum percentile of marks in essential qualification will be provided in respect of SCST and PWBD category. Okay, however, the above relaxation in minimum qualifying percentage of marks in education qualification is applicable in respect of posts which are reserved for SCST PWBD categories. Okay, so try to go through that information. No rounding off in marks to the next higher digit will be allowed for calculation of percentage of marks secured in bachelor's degree, master's degree, etc. Example 64.99 will not be considered as 65% for unreserved category. So, they are very strict in this aspect dear students kindly go through this information. So, minimum essential educational qualifications required for each post shall be as indicated in table 1 above against each post. Only full time regular courses will be considered. So, try to go through these points very, very carefully, dear students, before applying for this particular post. All qualifications must be from UGC governed Indian University, UGC recognized Indian deemed university, or AICT approved courses from autonomous Indian institutions cons concerned statutory council, which wherever applicable. Minimum percentage of marks in the essential qualifications as specified shall be considered as per institute, university rules or norms. Wherever CGPA, OGPA, CPI or letter grade in a degree is awarded, equivalent percentage of marks should be indicated in the application as per the norms adopted by the university. So, engineering degree can be BE, BTEC or BSc engineering. Candidates having 5 year BE, BTEC plus ME, MTEC integrated dual degree in engineering in relevant discipline shall also be considered. Okay. So, candidates who have completed their bachelor's degree in engineering including 5 years 
बी बीटेक प्लस एम एम टेक इंटीग्रेटेड ड्यूएल डिग्री इन इंजीनियरिंग एम सी ए डिग्री फॉर ई टी बी आई एस ओनली इन द ईयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर और कैंडिडेट्स हु आर करेंटली इन द फाइनल ईयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव ऑफ देयर इंजीनियरिंग डिग्री कोर्स इंक्लूडिंग फाइव ईयर्स बी ई बी टेक प्लस एम ई एम टेक इंटीग्रेटेड ड्यूएल डिग्री इन इंजीनियरिंग कोर्स और एम सी ए डिग्री ओनली आर एलिजिबल टू अप्लाई फॉर द पोस्ट ऑफ एग्जीक्यूटिव ट्रेनिंग इन ई टू ग्रेड सो फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट्स करंट फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट्स ऑल्सो कैन अप्लाई फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर पोस्ट दैट इज वॉट इज गिवन हियर डियर स्टूडेंट्स सो कैंडिडेट्स हु हैव कंप्लीटेड देयर बैचलर डिग्री इन इंजीनियरिंग इंक्लूडिंग फाइव ईयर्स बी बी टेक प्लस एम ई एम टेक इंटीग्रेटेड डूएल डिग्री इन इंजीनियरिंग एम सी ए डिग्री फॉर ई टी बी आई एस ओनली इन द ईयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर एंड बिलोंगिंग टू जनरल ई डब्ल्यू एस एंड ओ बी सी एन सी एल कैटेगरी मस्ट हैव सिक्योर्ड मिनिमम सिक्सटी फाइव परसेंट मार्क्स एंड कैंडिडेट्स बिलोंगिंग टू एस सी एस टी पी डब्ल्यू बी डी कैटेगरी मस्ट हैव सिक्योर्ड मिनिमम सिक्सटी परसेंट ऑफ मार्क्स सो दिस इज वॉट इज गिवन हियर सो ट्राई टू गो थ्रू ऑल दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन डियर स्टूडेंट्स selection of candidates who are currently in the final year of their engineering degree course okay so including 5 years be btech me mtech integrated dual degree or mca degree will be further subject to obtaining minimum 65% marks in case of general ews obc ncl category candidates and minimum 60% in case of sc st pwd that is what is given candidates who have completed their bachelor's degree in engineering or mca degree in relevant discipline branch in the year 2023 or earlier are not eligible to apply so this is what he has given here dear students the upper age limit is 26 years as on 18th march 2025 for the posts of executive trainee in all disciplines however the relaxation in upper age limit as applicable is detailed in table 2 so here he has given sc st 5 years relaxation is there obc ncl 3 years then pwbd depending upon the category they have given the age relaxation so for general ews 10 years obc ncl 13 years and sc st 15 years is the age relaxation kindly go through this information maximum upper age of the applicant shall not exceed 56 years including all possible age relaxations so selected candidates will be placed in the pay scale of 60000 to 180000 at a basic pay of 60000 during one year training come probation period so during training and probation period you will get 60000 as executive trainee in e2 grade on successful completion of their training come probation period they will be absorbed in the same pay scale of 60000 to 180000 in e2 grade no protection of pay shall be admissible to the candidates joining gail in the above mentioned post so pay allowances basic pay as applicable in the grade variable dearness allowance at the applicable rates and perks and allowances under cafeteria approach okay variable pay performance related pay based on individual and organization performance then other benefits company accommodation leased accommodation hra medical facility group insurance etc and superannuation benefits besides contributory provident fund gratuity and pension employees who superannuate from gail after rendering a minimum of 15 years of service will also be entitled to post retirement medical benefits so prmb is also there dear students kindly go through this then placement and assignments during the training come probation period and or after absorption the candidates may be posted at any of the installations projects offices etc of gail limited or any of the subsidiaries so this is what is given health and medical fitness related information is given kindly go through that selection process and how to apply gail will be utilizing gate 2025 marks for recruitment of executive trainees in the above mentioned discipline during the year 2025 eligible candidates who wish to apply for the position of executive trainees in gail will be required to first register for gate 2025 and thereafter appear in gate 2025 as per instructions and timelines notified by gate 2025 organizing institute in one of the following relevant gate examination papers so now let us see what are the positions and the papers that are required dear students executive trainee chemical so disciplines chemical petrochemical chemical technology petrochemical technology chemical technology and polymer science chemical technology and plastic technology corresponding gate 2025 paper chemical engineering corresponding gate 2025 paper code ch then for instrumentation 
So already we have discussed about this instrumentation, instrumentation and control, electronics and instrumentation, electrical and instrumentation, electronics. So gate paper should be IN, instrumentation engineering paper. For electrical, so electrical engineering paper, EE is the paper code. For mechanical, mechanical engineering paper, ME is the code. And here mechanical production, production and industrial, manufacturing, mechanical and automobile can apply. Executive trainee, BAIS. So computer science, information technology. Then bachelor's degree with master's degree in computer application, CSIT paper and computer science and information technology paper code is CS. Okay, based on GATE 2025 marks and requirement, candidates will be shortlisted for further selection process for the position of executive trainee in the above disciplines. Please note that only GATE 2025 marks are valid for the recruitment exercise. GATE marks of 2024 or prior to that is not valid. So that is what is given here. The candidates who have registered with GATE 2025 are required to download the admit card from the GATE official website upon its activation on receipt downloading of GATE 2025 admit card with registration number. Candidates will have to separately apply online in GAIL indicating their GATE 2025 registration number in the career section of GAIL website. So here it is the URL that is given https colon double slash gaelonline.com. For this purpose, the relevant link will be made available in the career section of our website. So it may be noted that application without valid GATE 2025 registration number will be rejected. Candidates will be required to apply online through GAIL website. So this is the website URL dear students https colon double slash gaelonline.com. Okay indicating their GATE 2025 registration number, no other means or mode of application shall be accepted. The relevant link will be made available from 11 hours of 17 February 2025. So 17 February 2025 online application form will open. See GATE result will not be declared by the time. So you have to enter the GATE registration number of 2025 year only. GATE 2024 and before that score is not valid, only through GATE 2025 you have to apply. And last date to apply is 18th March 2025 up to 6 pm. So a candidate can apply for one post or discipline only. Candidates applying for more than one post discipline will not be considered. So kindly go through all this information dear students. So before applying, okay, so this is very very important information that is given in the 7th page document here. So opening date is 17th February 2025, 11 hours onwards, last date for submission 18th March 2025 up to 6 pm. For detailed information regarding GATE 2025, interested candidates may log on to the official website of GATE 2025. Okay, so here all the information is given, kindly go through the entire information before applying. So try to remember the time and date dear students 11 hours onwards from 17th February 2025 the online application is opening last date to register is 18th March 2025 up to 6 pm and remember that you have to take gate registration number from the official website and along with your online application you have to enter the registration number and you have to apply for only one post dear students okay thank you all the very best